Urgent Care. It's everything we provide to people who need, or think they need, urgent advice, emergency care, treatment or diagnosis. And it should mean a proper round-the-clock assessment of how urgently they need it. And the right response delivered when it's needed. So what makes urgent, urgent? Healthcare professionals define it as a condition needing assessment and intervention within a week or that will probably lead to an emergency in four weeks. And emergency care? It might not be life-threatening, but it does need quick assessment and a planned intervention within 24 hours. Here in Leeds, we have three urgent care options. Dial in 111, walking into A&E, a GP, a minor injury unit or walk-in centre, or calling an ambulance. Each week, nearly 4,000 people in Leeds visit A&E with 1,300 of them admitted to hospital. Over 3,000 people a week in Leeds call 111, leading to 300 ambulances being called out. Nearly 250 people referred to A&E and 2,000 referred to primary care. More than 2,000 ambulances are dispatched directly through 999 in Leeds and about 900 people visit minor injuries units at Wharfdale and St George's. So, what are the most important local issues? People don't understand what urgent care services are available at what times or people feel that we aren't currently providing the right services. Care can be split across different services so information needs to be repeated to different staff. Urgent care is complex and A&E can seem the easy and reliable option, so the number of people using A&E increases. With lots of urgent care options available, sometimes services are not always joined up, and GPs and other health professionals aren't always aware of all the local options. Some good pathways are in place, but patients don't always follow or know the best one for them. So what do we want to achieve locally? We want people to be able to access high quality and safe care seven days a week. Simple and efficient, guiding good choices by patients and healthcare professionals. In short, the right care in the right place and the right skills the first time. And what do we want to see overall? People only using A&E when they really need it. High quality and accessible primary and community care people having the support they need to manage their own health better and having healthier lifestyles. Managed care pathways and above all an easy way of accessing urgent care services. How we reach those goals is something we can do together. So now it's over to you.